this says let A be the set containing the three elements 2, 3, and 4, and B is the set containing 6, 8, and 10, and define a relation R from A to B as follows. For every ordered pair X and Y that's in the set A cross B, the ordered pairs in the relation means that y divided by x is an integer. So part A asks, is 4 related to 6? Now we can say, this is asking, is this ordered pair in my relation r? Is this an element of r? Now we know when an ordered pair is an element of r according to the definition of this relation, that means that my second element in the ordered pair divided by the first element in the ordered pair is an integer. So I wrote that in red over here. 6 divided by 4 is an integer. And that's false because 6 divided by 4 is 1.5 or 3 halves. That is not an integer. And so that means that this ordered pair is not in the relation, which means that 4 is not related to 6. So that's false. Is 4 related to 8? The answer here is yes, because 8 divided by 4 is an integer. That integer is 2. Is 3 related to 8, or is the ordered pair 3, 8 in the relation? No, because 8 divided by 3 is not an integer. Is 10 divided by 2 an integer? Yes, that integer is 5. So for part B, it says write R as a set of ordered pairs. It contains the set of all ordered pairs such that the second coordinate divided by the first coordinate is an integer. So if my first element is 2 from A, then my second element has to be divisible by 2, and all three elements in B are divisible by 2. So I can put 2, 6, I can do 2, 8, and I can do 2, 10. If I pick the first element to be 3, there's only one element in set B that is divisible by 3 which is, in this case, 6. The 6 divided by 3 is an integer. And if I pick 4, there's again only one element in B that I can divide by 4 to get an integer, and that's 8. But these are the only ordered pairs in my relation R. And that's the answer to part B. For part C, write the domain and the codomain of R. So my domain is the set of all of my elements in the first position of these ordered pairs. So that includes 2, 3, and 4. So in this case, my domain is the whole set A. My codomain is the set of all elements that are in the second coordinate of my ordered pairs, which is 6, 8, and 10. Now we have to draw an arrow diagram for R. So here I drew out A and B. And so now I have to draw arrows from my domain to my codomain. So 2 is related to 6, 2 is related to 8, and 2 is related to 10. 3 is related to 6, 4 is related to 8. This is what the arrow diagram for my relation R would look like. Thanks everyone, and I'll see you in the next video.